Okay, uh, a little test with the uh, the 4K camera after going through the settings on the camera. Um, <laughs> um, adjusting the uh, ISO, adjusting the, um, oh crikey, gain, ISO gain and shutter speed and uh, iris. And then the problem that I noticed was <laughs> when I pressed the buttons on the side of the camera, to um you know i thought oh that that's 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 that that's good um it just reverted back to um the other settings where the the image here would be a bit darker and you, you see this typical um rainbow color effect thinking thing gosh um yeah i had to press the button on the the back of the camera to sort of like kind of like say initialize it finalize it and then then it's set um still a little bit uh, i think that's i think that's okay I think that's like how it looks i don't know what it's like with the light off uh with the light off um yeah it looks okay i'd probably go over and over it again just just to be a little bit uh, maybe thorough, uh, but that looks okay. Um, just adjusting the tripod. Ah, oh, that looks okay. I was thinking, um, you know, there was a setting on on it that um, I wasn't quite doing right. My projector's still a little bit kinked um, because it's uh, tilting down quite a lot due to the port window. It's not large enough. Um, I'm thinking of making the port window just a little larger. I'm thinking of having the port window maybe made a little larger. Um, how do I go unmount the camera from the... Oh yeah. As I've got a new tripod. <coughs> I've got to familiarise myself. Um, I'll zoom in. Uh, focus automatically. Um, yeah, the port window needs, needs to be a little bit larger. Um, <coughs> not... Not considerably. There are two ways I can go around about it. One, take the MDF out. So you can see. Um, you can see there's a picture frame sort of around it, but just on the inside when turning a light on, which makes it a lot more, a lot more easier. Even though the ISO, I've got to readjust it manually. Um, There we go, I've got to adjust that manually and then uh, I can finalise it. Oh, while still recording. Oh, good. Okay, I'm slowly getting the hands on with the camera. So there's like a uh, MDF going around it, which I just, you know, I'm beyond that, it's just the, um, the breeze block bricks. Um, I can just take all that MDF out um, and then put a thinner sort of clean it up a little bit and then put a thinner air, uh, MDF in there um, yeah, and that would just make it kind of clean on the inside sort of thing but um, only talking like maybe the millimeters of the um, yeah and um yeah so if i've got to go yeah because that looks pushed out there so i've got to go back into there just that down and then finalize it there we go 
Yeah, I'm slowly, I think I'm slowly getting the, uh, you know, I've only had this uh, Sony um, 4K camera for a couple of days. Um, I thought it was all glitchy, but uh, it looks okay. Looks okay. I'm not, did a video the other day that kind of like, um, you know, Sony picture and all that. They kind of got a little bit snobby and they... You know, they didn't want the video up there, even though everyone's got a goddamn video of a clip of a movie, yeah, or movie clip trailers, yeah, you know. <laughs> um, it's not like I've got a whole goddamn film on, which I wouldn't even bother wasting my time. Um, but, yeah, that's how it looks at the moment. I think it looks okay. I think it looks, oh, it looks obviously, because of the screen and light shining, reflecting onto a screen is going to... You know, and that's a uh, like TV down there. It's like a direct view. Um, turn the camera, turn the light off. It's just got an auto focus. Auto focus. There we go. Yeah, looks okay. Colors look okay. Yeah. Um, of course, if I adjust the uh, the what's it where you see that um where we go uh, 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 is it that one there no oops i went a little bit too dark there see if i turn it down there you can see you can see these like shifting little and that's the uh that's the colour wheel effect. Um, or the uh, RGB, Y, C, whatever. <laughs> you know? So I'll just open the um, ISO to oh, well, the setting here to about. I think 8's a bit too exaggerated. Uh, maybe 15 and then. Initialize that. Okay, there we are. Okay.